Welcome back everybody, part 5, I believe, of our little Zelda playthrough, our little hype to get ready for Zelda Breath of the Wild. We're gonna return here, we're gonna go down to the surface in this episode. So that green beam of light is where I'm heading, I'm gonna go down, I'm gonna search for Zelda, hopefully she might be down there, if we don't know, I don't know, well I mean I do know, but you know, we're gonna find out together. How about that? Huh. We're gonna make our way casually all the way there. What do you want? Yeah, observe, blah, 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 green lights. Yeah, 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 I know. I know all that stuff. I get it. I get it. Okay, yep. Yep, I get it. Yep. 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 Some stuff, basically, I think so she was telling me to put, but no. Yeah. Just telling me where the thing is. It appears that you will be able to reach the surface by passing through that portal. I know that. <clears throat> because I'm the one who opened it. I'm gonna fucking dive down there like a mm, beast. Look at that shit. Skydive in! Getting down there, getting down to the surface. Coming to the first time going down to the surface in a very long time since the age of Skyloft. Yeah. Doing it. Plus, my mic keeps drooping down for some reason. Yeah. <laughs> eh, there we go. Hopefully, that'll stick. There we go. All right. Now, we're going down on the surface. Look at that. We're skydiving. We're just like gracefully falling down and then put out our sailcloth. So, we have a nice, safe landing. I don't even know how that works, but video game logic. That's how it does it. That's how it works. And now, this chick again is like, oh, we've arrived. I, I can clearly. Tell that. Thanks, Fee. I know that I've arrived. I mean, I did land here. We are on the surface. I don't give a shit about your calculations. But apparently, the location we're at is at the sealed grounds. So, that's the thing. The sealed grounds. Ooh. And down there... Down there's some stuff that I have to go down and find out. Look, there we are. We're on the surface, and there's Skyloft. Above everything. Yep, alright, I get it, I'm there, yep. Thank you, thank you game, thank you map. I get that I'm there and I kind of have to sneeze, but I don't know when it's gonna come, it might be coming soon. Ugh, uh, sneeze! But it's not coming yet. Alright, bitch, I'm gonna fucking chop the shit out. Gonna chop, Ugh. there we go. That's what I wanted the first time. Ugh. Suck it, ow, how the hell did I get hit there? Oh well. Oh, I really gotta sneeze, but like, all right, you know what? We'll give it, give him, give him some of this. <laughs> yeah, let's take that. <laughs> As if you didn't get cut from that. All right, there we go. Now we're gonna make our way down. <laughs> yeah, you can use the sailcloth to get safe landings. Now I really need a sneeze, but it's not coming out. Uh -huh. It makes my nose hurt a bit. It doesn't feel nice. I hate that feeling when you have to sneeze, but it just doesn't want to come out. I bet you know what that feeling is, it's just, ugh. It makes me schnozzle, block it, and yucky. Ugh. 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 My nose. It really hurts, I don't like it. And now we're having like some weird visions. Getting back to some game stuff. That piece of shit down there is what we're gonna have to fight later on. Don't remember when in the game, but it's later much later I'm gonna kick his ass when we get to him because he's a dick and he's like the evilness of this place <laughs> the evil evil ah. yeah because he's he's a bad bitch he don't like it all oh, right Come on, cutscenes. Ugh, man. After the last part, man, come on. I don't want to see any more cutscenes. I hate cutscenes. They're so annoying. And I can't skip them either. Because that'd be great if I could. I mean, sorry for you guys, but, like, you know, I want to do more gameplay than freaking cutscene play. I mean, it's called gameplay for a reason, not cutscene. Cutscene game footage. I don't know. Bit. All right, yeah, so we gotta go down there. Hit. Sailcloth the way down gracefully. Hit. 
sailcloth again. Got some graceful landings, and I gotta touch that thing. Oop, there we go. Yeah, we're gonna like get that. I think so. Or do we have to hit it with our sword, with our skywood beam of light? Is that right, or do we just touch it? I forgot. Ah, we gotta raise the sword of the goddess skyward, and we're gonna hit with some god light, some graceful beam of god ray, raying light doohickeys. There we go. All right, and wha! And you're gone. Piece of shit. Evil thing. Oh wait, that totally had symbols from the Ocarina of Time. I want to check this out. See on one side, the side that's like right there in the corner. That's the... That's the Zora one. Or the, yeah, the, like the thing of wisdom. I believe is what they want. <gasps> We've gotten dowsing! Nah, I already know how to do all that stuff. Look, now we can douse with Zelda! Ooh. Yeah, alright, Fee. I just, uh, I just want to get to the gameplay. Anyway, yeah, look. That's the one of the Zoras. That's the... I don't know. And that's the other one I don't know. Yes, alright. Dowsing, I get it. Yes, it's Dows. She's up here somewhere. I know where she is anyway. She's up at that temple that we took the hearts from. Alright. Lucky we don't have to run all the way up now. I mean, I did fall, like, the whole way down, but... That's fine. Alright. I'm not even near the top. Yep. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, oh, okay. Maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe not there. Um, where's the closest non-gate? That place? Yeah, that's the one. Alright, let's go. Hit! Get in there! Get in there! And we fly up. And we're at the temple thing. Yep, there we are. I don't even need that heart. I don't know why I went and grab it. Alright. I don't know why I went to grab it. Grab it. Words. It's very early in the morning. Well, not really that early. I mean, it's like 8.20. I don't like record like three parts today. So I can get ready for the week to come. Which is next week. Because next week on Friday is the day the Nintendo Switch releases. And I'm excited for it because I want to play the fucking shit out of the new Zelda game. Because Zelda. That's why I'm playing this. To get hyped for it. Which I am. Alright, I'm gonna quickly save. Save? Yes, I wanna save! Thank you, game! Let me save! And then we can get on with our story life. There we go. Beam of light shining down. And it's a old lady with a, like... What do they call it? Like the, the, the... I don't know what they call those things, but they're only like grand grandfather clocks, the weight that, like, makes the tickings. I don't know what it's called, but yeah, she's got that for her hair. It's like moving back and forth. The pendulum. Is it a pendulum? I think so. It's like a pendulum. I think so. that's what they call it. Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments, please. I mean, I could Google it, but I just can't be bothered because I'm playing this. But yeah. Oh, lady. <coughs> in a hat. Red. Big ass fucking hat there. With a droopy face and a pendulum hair looking thing. And she's telling us some shit that I was skimming reading and now I'm like yep sitting here to fulfill she's I think she's basically like waiting for me because she knows I was coming because she knows because she's very smart and she's like gifted in stuff that I'm not gonna spoil I mean she's not really gifted she just has a little sneaky secret which is cool um yeah some shit's gonna happen Spirit Maiden, blah blah blah, I reached his land in a manner. So I think so she's basically talking to us about the goddess or somebody. Spirit Maiden, yeah. The, uh, I have to sneeze and yawn at the same time. Ugh, that was horrible. That was a horrible feeling. I gotta yawn. <sighs> Alright, I'm good. <clears throat> Alright, fair enough. So Spirit Maiden might. She might actually be talking about Zelda. As a spirit maiden. Um, yeah, put the X upon the thing, blah, blah, blah. Um, yeah, so she's basically telling us where Zelda went off to. Because Zelda met her, and then she's like, oh, stuff. 
I'll tell you to go to this place. And then now she's telling us to go to this place because, like, she went there and she knows where we're looking from. And then we're going to go there. So I'm going to put down a cheeky marker. And that's what I have to do. Blah, blah, blah. Yep. Yeah, remove the beacon. Blah, blah, blah. I know the beacons. Beacons, basically, like, the easiest thing. So now you know where you have to go. That's what your point? I did. I did it. You haven't set a beacon over the exit. I put the fucking beacon over your dumb piece of shit fucking anus hole. I put the... Oh, God damn it. Look. There. Ooh. Ooh. There we go. Ooh. It's over the X. It's over the X. You want to, like, directly over the X? Look. There. There. Now it's over the X. Look. There. There you go. There. Yeah. Fuck you. You put it over last time and you're like, no, you don't put it over, but I did put it over because you're a you don't know shit. Stupid AI game stuff. Freaking crap. Ooh, treasure chest. I'll take that. I believe it's a slingshot we get. Do we get a slingshot? I know we get a slingshot. I'm sorry if I'm like... Yawning a lot. I mean, I mean sleep, right? Who needs that? Well, I mean, something. All right, this is just rupees. No, it's a potion. Oh, revitalizing potion. It fully replenishes your shield and also restores four hearts. That's the purple one, not the blue one. I don't remember what the blue one does. So is that all we had to get? Is there another chest here? Nope. Okay, wait, was there a chest there? Nope, that's something else. All right, so now we gotta go through that door, I believe. Yep. Alright. Get through this door. Go into a place where Zelda might be or she might not be. I don't know. I mean, I do know, but we're going to find out together. Ugh. Man, it's like having to sneeze but not being able to sneeze. Things really killing me. Like, really, like, makes my... <sighs> Tickle, nose, itch, stuff. And then yawning makes it even worse. I want to try my best to not yawn a lot. So, I don't, like, yeah, I mean, stuff happens, you know, people yawn, people get tired, I mean, it's pretty early in the morning for, like, a lot of people, and a lot of people are morning people, like me, I mean, even though I wake up at, like, 8, 8.30 every morning, but, fuck that, I hate it, I'm just gonna gather some rupees here, that's all, because, you know, you need them rupees, and then these bitches are gonna, are like, these red assholes are like, fucking with this guy and wanna be like, sup. Be like, sup, boy. Yeah, fuck you. I hate, I hate this combat now because you have to like, swing in the direction that they're not, that they don't have their bloody sword in and sometimes they change like exactly as you're gonna swing. It's really annoying. Whoa, thanks for jumping in there. Well, you weren't gonna do anything even though you could have like kicked their ass, but clearly you didn't. You're a Goron, mate. <sighs> ah, stop yawning. Alright. I'm gonna try and get all these yawns out. I should have gotten all these yawns out before I started recording, actually. Ugh. Terribly sorry, people. I'm sorry that I have to do this. I'm sorry I'm yawning so much. Uh, I'm gonna let yawn again. <sighs> ah! Alright. Finding some of those statues. Those are my save statues, thank you. I'm gonna walk up to that and be like, Yo, check this shit out. And I'll be like, ha, saved. Um, sure. Yeah. Yeah, sure. I'll, I'll I'll be as enthusiastic as you are, just to get on your good side. Cause you're a friend, and I need a friend down here on the surface for this stuff. Stop yawning! Ah, uh, it's, uh, it's annoying me now that I'm yawning so much. I shouldn't have like, reco recorded this today, but my internet's not great for uploading. And then I'd have to go to my dad's work to do it. And I can't be bothered doing that again. 
Amazing, right? Wrong. Whoa, cool. Um, sure. Sure, I'll, I'll do some stuff. He's basically, like, telling us, like, basically everything he's searching is, like, all of the stuff that I can activate because of, like, the goddess and all that stuff. And then this guy's just like, what? You did stuff? Like this, see? I walk near and he's like, whoa. But he doesn't actually know it's me. Yeah. Like, he thinks we're using, like, magic and stuff, but it's just like, what? That's shit happening. Stop yawning! Ah! Alright, I'm really, uh, I really need to get all these yawns out. Yeah, sure, I'll save. And we can also go to the sky. How about that? We can go back into the sky and go back to Sky Lofty. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah. Statue reacted to you. What did you do? Come on, do it. Do it. Do it. Beg you. So, yeah, he kind of, like, f knows that we've done something but doesn't at the same time. But fuck that guy. Not really. He's cool. He's a friend. And we need him as friend. Alright, we're gonna move this big ass log now. Yep, there we go. There, look, there's our beacon. There's our little blue beacony thing that we set. And we can fuck it off now. Look at that. Hey, I'm gonna go to the map and piss it off. How about that? Uh, there we go. Get rid of that because I know where I'm going. Even though I already knew where I was going before I even set the beacon down. Because I'm not dumb. Now I'm burping. What is going on with me? God, mornings, right? I hate mornings. Ugh. Oh man, those tree textures. Oof. They're amazing. Amazing textures, right? Look at those 2D tree feather things. I mean, it kind of works in the style, but I mean, like. A whole bunch of them. Flat like that. I don't know about that. But anyway, games, you can't really do much about them. You gotta get that game efficiency so the game doesn't break. And I know that because I'm, I studied game design or game development, whichever we're gonna call it. All right, map, get it. Cool. I know where I'm going, anyway. Fuck off, Fee. Just let's, let's, let's get to the game. Let's just find Zelda. Do all that stuff. Oh my God. Stop yawning. Ah. Uh. Ah, ah, bang, bang. All right, um, swing across here. Hit and hit and then jump and then roll. Not really roll. All right, this tree has a rupee in it, which we're gonna get. There we go. Aha. There was another rupee. There it is. All right, dowsing. Fuck off. I know where she is. God damn, dude. Ow. I didn't even realize I had that thing on me. See ya. Alright, oh yeah, I gotta freaking these weird guys, the ki ki kikuis, kukuis, something. Bitch, fight me. Stop. Alright, there we go. I have to like take these freaking sword swings slow because it freaking annoys the crap out of me when they do that. Alright. Sup, dude? Little weird plant thingy. With a tiny ass face that looks like a mask. It's really weird. You're a weird looking thing. But they sound really cute. 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 There we go. Cute. Cool weep. Well, I'm just going to find you again. Yeah, he's going to run away. We're going to have to like track him down and talk to him. And this uh, fucking fee. All right. Okay. Mm, really? Really? Yeah, characteristics and blah 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 piece. Kick kickwees. 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 However you say it. I don't know. It would have been good if there was voice acting in these games so you, they could actually pronounce these hard words. But they don't. But anyways. Fee can shut the fuck up. I really wish you could just like disable Fee from talking so much. Like it should really ask you if you've like played the game before so you don't have to hear her shit all the time. But unfortunately they didn't do that. And it's really annoying. Because, I mean, I just want to play the game because I know everything. Like, even in a hard difficulty, she still does it. She's like, oh, I got to do this stuff. I'm like, I'm playing on a hard difficulty. Of course, I played this game before. Shut up, Fee, already. Because you suck. And you're annoying. I'm going to save. Whenever this remote decides to respond. And I'm going to yawn again. I don't want to yawn. 
But I can't help it. It happens. But it's up. <sighs> I'm gonna cut that. All right, here we go. Scare the bejeebles out of him. He runs off again. I believe he hides somewhere behind a tree. There he is. Hey, guy. Just cut that mushroom again. Scare the little flower out of you. And then he'll run off somewhere. He ran off in this direction. Alright, this is the hard thing that I hate. Oh, there he is. Because, like, he runs off in one direction, but then, like, he's actually in somewhere else. I'm gonna kill those bastards just to get rid of them. And there he is. Found ya. Found ya. Ha ha ha. Ha oh, oh, ha oh. ha. Scare the flower out of you again. Your camouflage isn't that great, dude. Yeah, he's scared of shit. He's scared. Basically, he like thinks we're one of like the gr the red guys, and we're gonna like eat him. But apparently, we're not. Well, I mean, we don't because we're not ugly monsters like them. Um, I'm Maki. That's the Kikwi's name. Maki, and he's funny, and he tells us stuff, and I should probably end this part, because it's gone on for a while, um, yeah, alright, after this, this dude talks, I'm gonna end the video here, and then, I'm gonna record the other video straight after, part six, yes, uh, Fee, shut the fuck up, yep, 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 I get it. I get it, Fee. I get it. And now we gotta find the Elder. Oh, far out. I sort of stopped yawning here. <clears throat> I'm gonna have to like pause for a bit and get all the yawns out of me before I start the next part. But anyways, alright. Fee, shut up so I can end this video, so I can end this part, so I can tell these lovely audience people what to do at the end of the video. Oh, come on. Come on, mate. All right. We get it. Yeah, we need to find the Elder. He's going to tell us. Basically, we're going to tell the Elder that they're safe. And then we have to find another couple of these dudes. And then we have to... Then he tells us where Zelda went. Anyways, all right. That's it for this part, finally. After all this long, bloody talking and cutscene bullshit. Um, so, yeah, that's it for this video, guys. I will... <laughs> see you in the next video which I'm actually gonna record straight after this one and then after that video another part and then I'm gonna edit it all and then upload it when I go to Dean's house to record other videos yeah Zelda hey guys if you like that video be sure to subscribe to the channel which you can actually click on the screen right now if you hit that logo where the subscribe word and the arrows pointing to you can do that and you can subscribe to the channel so you can keep updated and notified when we release a new video. And also, if you click on the other side, you will go back to our last video that we released. Hope you enjoyed, guys.